Remember, why are they saying we need to upload into a fake universe? Because death is a disease. These folks in medical terminology, they count death as any other disease. So if they're in the business of curing disease and they taught you death is a disease, why you think the God, why you think all the gods we serve will heal us? But they never heal nobody, but they promise eternal life. Jesus couldn't come heal nobody for COVID-19, but people still waiting on eternal life from these gods. It's because these gods never really healed no sicknesses. They only healed this illness they was trying to heal was death. But death ain't none we need no healing from because death ain't no sickness. Death is not an illness. Now, if somebody think death is a disease or some sort of curse, guess what? They would think the same thing about life because they want in the same. And what do these folks teach us? That life is a curse. Being born is a sin. A people who, who teach us that got an agenda behind it. If they telling you something wrong with you and some wrong with the world you built in, what would be their agenda? If they telling you some wrong with your human self and some wrong with this earth we live in as humans, what would be the agenda for telling you that? You know what it'll be? Let me build another version of you and let me build another earth. Y'all better wake up. These people showed up for 7,000 years telling us something wrong with us and something wrong with the earth. And now today they done rebuilt us and rebuilt the earth. They got new bodies for all of y'all. Who else promised you that though? Jesus, Yahweh. They, who else told you something was filthy and wrong with the earth? Jesus, Yahweh said, man, that earth is, is so corrupted. I'm going to make a new earth for you. You know what, man? That body that you got is so sinful. sinful. Let me make a new body for you. Y'all don't get these folks got some game, but I can see through it, though. You ain't, you ain't going to fool me. See, when you show up telling me what's wrong with you, I'm going to automatically go to thinking like that. Like, what's going to be your agenda? Because you trying to sell me something. It's something you want from me. Because, listen, if ain't nothing wrong with your toilet and, and you allow a plumber to, to do a survey on your house, what you think he going to tell you? Oh, your pipes work just fine. Thank you. No, man, he going to have to tell you something wrong with it. I don't care how good your plumbing is. If you let that plumber prove me, go hire a company right now. Tell them to come give me the free inspection for my pipes. Now, you know ain't nothing wrong with your pipes, but get the free inspection. Oh, they going to find something wrong, buddy. That inspection ain't free. The cost of that is a headache, a new worry, because the plumber know if you let me get this free inspection, when I look at your shit, I'm going to scare you with something. It's going to be something you didn't know about. Now, the plumber just giving game. Ain't nothing wrong with your pipes, but he going to find something to scare you about. And what you going to end up handing over your power, which is in this case would be your money. And paying for something you didn't need. Now, what if he go and break something and you pay him to break it and you be like, wait, something else messed up. Now you got to hire him again. Your pipes was working just fine. Now everything happening to your pipes all of a sudden when you hire this plumber. That's what happened to the world. Everything was just fine. And we start listening to these folks. Some wrong with that. Some wrong with you. Some wrong with you. Some wrong with the woman's beauty. That's why we got a damn multi-trillion dollar beauty industry. Some wrong with the way you smell. Spray this cologne on. Some wrong with the way you look. The way you talk. You ain't got the name brand clothes on. 
they got to convince you something wrong with you is what I'm showing you. Problem creation. This is Hegel's thesis. 